What's up guys? Hello, welcome back to a new video. Hi guys, what's up? I miss you. It's been a hot minute since I did a get ready with me slash chatty get ready with me. So for today's video, I'm actually attending an event in a couple of hours. So I wanted to do this little get ready with me because a lot of you guys have actually requested me to do vlogs and get ready with me. Like those are probably the two most requested um, video ideas or videos that you guys wanted to see from me besides like um, show us what you eat in the day video but i'll talk more about that in a few so anyways if you're trying to get ready and you want to get ready with me just go ahead and grab some snacks while you and i just chit chat i think i'm tired of having long hair right now especially because like it's super dry and it's just like not okay no not the look for me right now i know it doesn't look like it especially when i straighten my hair but you guys it's so freaking dry also i asked you guys to leave me some questions to answer in this q a video so if you would like to participate in like future q a's just go ahead and follow my instagram because that's where i drop my little q a box um i like 12 God. so the first thing i like to do is to moisturize my lips and right now i have this really like bad not cold sore but it's like outside of my lip like on this side right here and i'm really scared to go to the dentist because you know how like in the dentist they like open your mouth and it like hurts so bad so i've just been putting like the rosebud salve on that corner we're gonna go ahead and use a serum this is the elf beauty shield vitamin c pollution prevention serum i love this one um and it's from the drugstore it's like 11 dollars. honestly you can't beat it and it does amazing to my skin so i'm gonna go ahead and let's do that the most popular video requests that i get from you guys are closet tour what i eat in the day video get ready with me and vlogs and of course like my hauls so i'm gonna go ahead and curl my lashes because i don't like curling my lashes when i have foundation on because when i go like this it leaves a mark i am not like other girls on youtube that has a very healthy breakfast lunch and dinner just because like i grew up eating rice and i also grew up in a filipino household so like so what i eat in a day will consist of like chicken adobo like la uya pinak bed um Bulalo or something it's not gonna be like this is my dinner it's like salad which i'm not like making fun of girls who eat salad and stuff so if i film a video on what i eat in a day just you know don't be surprised that it's not like salad or healthy because it's really hard not to eat rice at least like in my house because my dad cooks really bomb food and i love filipino food so it's just like it's just my culture. So up next, we have the Laura Mercier Foundation Primer. They actually sent this to me as PR, and I haven't tried it, as you can tell, because I still have the box also. I love my nails, you guys. It's so summery, and I'm in love with it. I actually got two of the other girls at the nail salon to get the exact same one, because they're like, oh my god, I should do that. What are the colors you use? And I was like, ask her, ask my nail lady, because I wasn't the one who picked out the colors. I just kind of like showed her a picture. But anyways, they're so cute. Oh, okay, so this is the Laura Mercier Foundation Primer. It's a lightweight, water-based, vitamin-rich gel that creates the perfect canvas for makeup application. Oh, whoa. I was not expecting that, but that's so cool. So this is the little consistency, I guess you could, I don't know, guys, I'm not a makeup pro. Oh, this is the NYX Professional Makeup Precision Brow Pencil in the shade Soft Brown. First question is from Carla Faye Hernandez. When are you going back to visit the Philippines? Much love. Um, honestly, I'm not sure at the moment. I think I was supposed to go next month, like this August or like before October to get my grandma, but I'm not sure because I'm still in school, so I can't like miss that, so... Right now, I have no idea. I mean, hopefully next summer or like next Christmas because I really want to spend it, spend it with my cousins. But as of right now, I do not know. Also, I'm giving away 15 bikinis here on my channel. So if you haven't seen that video, I'll put the link down below. Any incoming college freshman advice you could give, love you. Oh, this is from Jersey Hi, Teresa May. If there's one thing I can advise you incoming freshmen out there, especially like if you're going to college, is that manage your time properly. Like time management is the key to passing classes. It's basically the key to have a less stressful life in college. When I went to college, like as a freshman, 
I was like, oh my god, like this is it. This is it. I have all the freedom because I'm gonna be dorming. So I'm like, I'm I don't have my parents to tell me this and that. Mom and dad, I love you guys, but you're like, you know. But yes, yeah, so I was like, oh my god, like I have all the freedom to do like this and that. And by this and that, I mean like nothing bad, but I'm just saying like you have the freedom to basically do anything or like don't do anything. And you need to manage your time wisely when it comes to school, your classes, to like partying because you know like partying is a part of college. It's a part of growing up you will go through it so that is like one of my biggest oh my god hi so yeah just like manage your time wisely also be open-minded um is another advice i would give because you know high school and college are very two different things where do you see yourself in five years okay in five years how old am i now i'm 23 oh my god that's 28 in five years i hope to have my own business already i also want to be a fiance at the age of 27. i don't know if you guys know that about me but like i want to get married before i hit 30. like 29 to 30. so like 27 28 is like a good time for me so you know ralph we're gonna go ahead and apply this cc cream this is the one from it cosmetics i heard a lot of great things about this one and i want to try it because i always use the Too faced born this way and I actually just got a new one but it's summer i just want to try something a little lighter that's not a foundation so i got a lot of recommendations to try this one and this is in the shade rich the girl said that this is my shade and she works at sephora so we're about to see if this really is my shade so looking a little orange on my skin Jesus take the wheel I'm gonna go ahead and use my morphe beauty blender to blend it and let's see I honestly like heard a lot of great things about this one I just don't know if i got my right shade like she didn't like really like test test me like she was just like this is your shade i'm just like oh okay you're not even gonna test me you're not gonna even apply it on my skin like am i like not worth your time yo mm, i think i kind of like it i don't know if i like smell that from the product or it's like my beauty blender uh, okay see it looks super orange on the camera but like here it looks fine what kind of camera do you use for most of your videos so there are two cameras that i really only use one i have the canon 80d which has like a flip out screen and it's really really helpful the second one i have is the canon g7x mark ii which is the one i'm filming on right now both camera reach or has the quality that i look for in videos um and they were definitely an investment they're not cheap <laughs> what i have is from my friend caroline and she's like hi no question just miss you <laughs> i miss you too friend would you ever come to toronto canada love you yes of course oh my god i love you guys i would love to visit canada when are you seeing jervis again oh my god you guys i miss my brother okay um i'm not sure i'm really hoping like my whole family is really hoping that he comes home in december um and if he does we're gonna go to hawaii i'm gonna go ahead and set my face using the laura mercier translucent loose setting powder but this is the glow one i have the original one which is the translucent one but um i want to try this i want to glow and they also sent this to me as pr so thank you so much laura mercier um but i am oily so actually let me go ahead and set my face no 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 let's just go ahead and use the glow so this is the glow this is the original so um hopefully i don't look like a grease ball i love glowing you guys but i have an oily skin and sometimes i'm just like you need to relax because you look like a disco ball oh no oh my god no 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 oh my god this is not blend with my cc cream oh no guys okay so look how glowy i am like that's literally a glow powder okay 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 okay, okay. i'm just gonna go ahead and apply the regular translucent powder which is right here oh my god anyways i'm stressed i'm stressed look how it's glowing i should have just like applied it here oh 
Okay, let's just answer some questions so I don't think about it. A little tip, guys. If you're going to use the Laura Mercier translucent powder in the shade Glow and you're an oily person, um, make sure you only apply it to the highlights of your face because... Yeah, it's a lot. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and bronze and I'm gonna use the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. I'm gonna go ahead and use this one, which is the darkest shade. Next one we have is from Anlin. Nine underscore. She was like, how did you get close with your parents? Love you, Atafrina. Oh my god, you guys, I love it. Oh my god, do you see that glow? It's literally all my cheeks, bro. How did I get close to my parents? Um living with them i'm kidding um i think it's i don't know i don't really know how to answer this question i think i'm like pretty family oriented honestly like me and my brother are because we spend time with them a lot like we live under the same roof and also like we set aside time to like have family time or like we go on family trips and all that stuff so i think just by having those like intimate moments you get a relationship with your parents as opposed to someone who like don't spend a lot of time with their parents if that makes sense i hope that answered your question i'm gonna go ahead and take this like slanted brush and dip it to the regular translucent powder and apply it in the bridge of my nose just like brighten up that area what do you look for in a guy what do i look for in a guy um one family oriented two goal oriented three a really nice man um and four just someone who can make me laugh and you know that was basically ralph there we go. You know why I looked orange? It's because my lighting bumped down. That's why. So now this is the actual color of the foundation. Tips and tricks to staying fit. Just being active in your life, whether that's like going to the gym, finding like a workout class. For me, I like to stay active by going to hot Pilates and um, spin class. And I also go to the gym and by drinking water. I rarely, if ever, only drink soda and that's like at family parties or just like when there's like no water available to be completely honest just drink water go work out go to the gym just find something um that you can do to be active on a daily basis and you don't even have to go to the gym honestly like you can find workouts on youtube and do them at your house like when i was in high school i obviously didn't have my own money to like pay for a um gym membership so what i did is like i looked up workouts online and you can find a ton of free workouts that you can follow at home. If you could visit somewhere you've never been before, where would it be? Santorini, Greece, or Italy. But I also want to go to like Bora Bora, Fiji, the Maldives, and just like anywhere tropical. Why did you start YouTube? And actually, this is like one of the most requested questions that I get online and in person. And I didn't start YouTube to make it a career. Like I honestly started filming YouTube videos because I was like, oh my god, like I love Michelle Fan and Bethany Mona and I kind of like want to start like creating videos. And I didn't think that like people would actually like watch me because I do a lot of hauls and just like I just like really didn't think people would watch me but then here I am and I have you guys so thank you so much for watching okay let's take a break from questions I'm gonna go ahead and use blush this is the Tarte Cosmetics Amazonian just kidding this is the Tarte Cosmetics Rainforest After Dark Colored Clay Eye and Cheek Palette I've used this before I don't know what shade this is Tarte Cosmetics if you know what shade this is please you don't even have to send it to me i can buy it myself but if you know what this is please tell me because i this is my favorite favorite blush ever and i'm hitting pan and i'm like getting worried what's your lucky number easy six which is my birthday my favorite number favorite boba drink my favorite boba drink is probably a mango slush with boba or like taro slush would you ever get a tattoo yes i get a tattoo but i don't know like what it is like i really have to think about it if i really want a tattoo like it's not something that i would just like get but yeah i mean like if i have something that i really want then it's my body just kidding i don't have any tattoo right now mom if you're thinking that if you could eat one type of food for the rest of your day what would it be I was gonna say seasick, but I love tacos, but I also love sushi, so I think it's seasick. Like, I love, love seasick, you guys. Like, it's just, it's amazing. I'm gonna use an eyeliner. I'm gonna use an eyeshadow. This is the Patrick Star from MAC Cosmetics, um, and this is the 
Glam AF palette and I like to use this shade right here. It's not black. It's just like a really dark brown color and it's what I use to give myself a little cat eye look. I feel like this is just like better than using an eyeliner because it has a softer look to it and you can easily like blend it as opposed to like an eyeliner where if you like mess up, you mess up. For mascara, I have the CoverGirl Exhibi Exhibitionist Hydrofuge Mascara. This is um, the very black and it's also waterproof. I'm going to take the glow powder, which is this one, and let's go ahead and put it in the bridge of our nose and use it as a base of our highlight before we go in with an actual highlighter. Before I forget, I'm going to go ahead and highlight my brow bone using the cream shade from this palette. And I'm going to go ahead and take this flat shade of brush right here. I'm going to go ahead and dip that. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and set my brows using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Clear Brow Gel. This one will cement your brows, guys. I need a new one, actually. Um, so I'm just going to go ahead and brush this. For my lips, I'm going to go ahead and use this OG one that I've been using since probably like I was a freshman in college. This is from Rimmel London. This is the Lasting Finish Lip Liner in the shade Spice. And just like to apply that there. Make sure you like moisturize your lips before applying this because it dries it out really bad. Maybe that's why I have this thing right here. Last but not least, I have the Urban Decay All Nighter Summer Solstice Setting Spray. And this is amazing. It smells so good. Oh, I just want to eat this, guys. Why do I still look 12? Okay, wait. I actually have a new highlighter that I've been meaning to try. Um, Laura Mercier also sent this. This is the Indiscretion Highlighter. I know I already have a highlight, but like, you know, like, it, no one's gonna... It's fine if you're glowing. So, ooh. Okay, let's see. Ooh. I mean, I don't know if it did anything because it was already blinding, but like... I mean, like, look at that highlight, though. Alrighty, guys, that concludes my try to get ready with me. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will try to do more of these just to, like, keep you guys updated with what's going on because apparently you guys really want me to, to like, update you guys. But thank you, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, if you guys want to see more videos like this, please give this video a big thumbs up and go ahead and join my giveaway because I am giving away 15 bikinis. So I'll put the link down below. So anyways, I love you guys so, so, so much, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!